Well, we're just two weeks away from that total solar eclipse. And with the crowds of people gathering here using their cell phones, those wireless networks will be pretty busy April 8th. And as many of us will be trying to capture the moment on our phones and communicate with each other, 5 News reporter Morgan Wrigley shows us how phone companies are working hard to keep us connected. Good morning, Morgan. Good morning. Well, as thousands or even more than a million of people are expected to visit Arkansas for the eclipse, our wireless network is going to be under a lot of pressure. But Verizon tells 5 News it's been working ahead of time to prepare for this, and there's not much to worry about with our cell phones. Guillermo Salina, Senior Director of Network Performance, says with so many people trying to use the network at once, it's like the phones are waiting in line to connect. And if there's not enough space on the network for those devices, that's where the slowdowns happen. But he says that's not much of a concern for our area. Many of the towers have been upgraded to 5G, and he says his team is constantly monitoring and adding capacity to our wireless network. In the past uh, 12 months, we've added 12, uh, six more towers. Uh, in addition, we've increased the capacity of the individual existing sites. So we don't have concerns uh, due to this event. He says they'll also be monitoring the network 24-7, but says you shouldn't expect to see many slowdowns while using your phone April 8th. Morgan Wrigley, 5 News.